Good morning, everyone, and welcome back. Let's check in with last night's sleep research. Hoping everyone had a good night's rest. It's particularly good for me. I feel quite rested, so I'm hoping to see a good chunk of slumbering sleep last night. Full 100 sleep score. Three less minutes than yesterday, but no biggie. All right. Yeah, getting to sleep, <laughs> a lot of slumbering, but a lot of cyclical sleep. <clears throat> Maybe that's what's actually a little more restful. It was fun to see. But uh, nearly completely balanced between the three. But dozing wins out based on historical averages. Because I don't get a lot of dozing sleep. I'm usually out. again. Good. 47 million drowsy power. We have a full house fully represented. Let's see who showed up. We got gulping atop belly. See May. Oh, no, nope, that's primate hanging out down there. Two croaks. Maybe one of them will be hungry this time. Primate. I feel like I'm... There we go. Gulpin. Anybody else? I feel like I'm... Eh, <laughs> Psyduck and Chikorita. Alright. So we have a very big repeat of kind of basically yesterday's loadout with just a couple of more primates. <laughs> Alright. But still... If one of those Toxicroaks could be, you know, hungry, that'd, that'd be real nice. No one. <laughs> the darkest gift of all. Yeah, as much as I, I enjoy the fact that they're showing up, I need the lower level evolution in order, you know, I need... Pro gunk in order to be able to really easily recruit it. I'm not going to be just going through all of my biscuits just to <laughs> just to recruit. All right, we're going to do lather, rinse, repeat from yesterday. Chikorita is there. Still looking for a good Chikorita. The one from yesterday was not good. And thank goodness Good Sleep Day is right around the corner because I need some more sleep points to pick up some more biscuits. Alright, and that's where we'll leave that. I think I'm only one biscuit away anyway from hitting the goal, so... Yeah, I guess we can leave the... Uh... Toxic rope can as the shareable. So close. Tomorrow. Banking on tomorrow. Alright, let's see what we got. Sassy Nature Chikorita. This one doesn't have Berry Finding S yes, in its 10th level skill. But we got Cocoa Honey Honey. Just not too bad of a spread. Energy Recovery Bonus. Berry Finding S in the level 25, though. Inventory up. Helping speed and skill trigger. With main skill chance up. Not that bad. This one I at least have better feeling about. Energy recovery is nice. I wish it were a little bit later on. It's kind of something to kind of like help give it that extra boost. But Berry Finding S in the first two slots is very good to see. Inventory up M. Really great to see. That could be uh, subskilled up to inventory up L. Helping speed is also like this at least has some potential. And main skill chance up. I mean, charge strength is good. 
helping speed, you know, speed of help would, would certainly be a much better nature, but at this point, beggars can't be choosers. I'm just looking for one that's like somewhere in the 80 plus percentile. I decided yesterday to swap out Squirtle on the team for the Pinsir to start collecting some EXP, as well as just kind of kick the tires proverbially, see what it uh, can really do when tasked to collect ingredients. Alright, some more diamonds for sticking to bedtime, and oh yeah, just one more biscuit, and we're, we're good for some more handy candy. So I feel good about that. Tomorrow we'll have all of that squared away. No additional sleep style, so we're still on 15. But... Those earlier sleep... I mean, 99 is <laughs> messing with my round number. Does that bother anybody else? <sighs> anyway... Uh, now that we're on news, important to call out, there was a update. It's, I don't, it has not been forced to my knowledge, but it does help to resolve, for the most part, the player icon issues being seen from maintenance earlier this week. So now we can head down there and we can see a much larger swath of shiny Pokemon to choose as the icon. And no, and it has been a addressed as far to their socials that you may be seeing some Pokemon evolutions in there that I haven't don't actually have in my teams but because I have evolutions within the family you will see some of them there so I could put shiny war total if I wanted to even though I don't have one yet good but I won't not until I need that second one I want to I want Shiny Squirtle. It's too adorable. How's the community doing? 38 reports. We're back on the, the lower slot. I will take rank ups, though. That is always helpful. Thankfully, these last couple of weeks, I've just been able to kind of really, well... During Raiko, I did kind of burn through some to get some ingredients, but I haven't had to resort to using ingredient tickets as much, so it feels good that I've got a nice little backstock of them. Okay. No trigger from you, Charizard, today. That's okay. Good to see from you, Blastoise. Pincer with a lovely 10 honey. So we're set up really well for tomorrow. Got a good chunk of ingredients to be able to make some, some bigger stuff that I normally don't get to make. And I also even have, uh, through triggers, enough slowpoke tails to make the tail pepper salad. Which actually might not be a bad way to start off today. Strictly for the fact that uh, I should have enough for the calm mind fruit salad for tomorrow. And this is a nice way to get a good bang out for the morning. Let's see... All right, give it a little bit. No extra tasty, but that's all right. Still, by itself, 16,231 dishes strength. 
getting it some good rank ups to get it a little bit more oomph for the next time it's made. If I could get tails a little bit more reliably, this would be a wonderful dish to make too. Basically any of the slow poke tail dishes are pretty great at uh, getting some good dish strength being a very powerful ingredient. Master 7, so... Where we're at... Master 10 may be reattainable. Thank you, Wigglytuff. I am finally learning my lesson. I do reserve the right to forget it later, though. At the recovery Pokemon. Done. Yeah. Sorry, Dodrio. Get them done after eating, so it just piles on some additional recovery. But yeah. Things are looking good. Stat-wise, we've got... About another 60,000 to get to Master 8, so it's possible by the end of the night, between sneaky snacking, lunch, and dinner. Uh, and then Sunday will probably be one of those days where it's just a big cook in the morning, make that calm mind fruit salad, and then just chill for the rest of the day, picking back up on ingredients so that way things go nice and smooth for the rest of the week, keeping that nice big surplus of ingredients. Uh, and on this team, that really won't be too much of a problem. Probably swap out Wigglytuff and see if I can get some other ingredient collector on there that I might need. What do y'all think? Who would be a, a good swap out for that to grab some ingredients without knowing what's coming up in the week ahead? I'm just curious. But that is what I have for today. Thank you once again for stopping by and checking out what's going on in my world for sleep research. And I'll see you back tomorrow for some more. But until then, sleep well.